Hi guys, uh, I'm Verity and uh, I am the owner of Pelican's House. Uh, you've uh, probably been emailing with me. I'm just here at the moment and I thought I'd give you guys a video around the place so you can see what you're coming to. So this is your entranceway and we're in the village of Niohori, which means new village. Uh, which is just above the holiday village of Nidri. So let's take a little look. So we come into, straight into the, the kitchen area. We have a little toilet in here. And then you have a fully equipped utility room with a washer dryer microwave, lots of storage, bits and pieces in here. And then we have the kitchen. I love the kitchen. This is um, an Italian designed kitchen, granite worktops. You've got your dishwasher, cooker, the yeah, stove top. And all of our holidays, um, all of our guests get a welcome pack. So this is a little intro into what you've got. So you've got bread, you've got coffee, tea, sugar, uh, you've got olive oil and balsamic. And then we also have a couple little bits and pieces in here for you to get you started. And some ice in the fridge for the all important drinks. Um, lots of different bits and pieces in here. You've got your internet, um, sort of your stash cupboard, bits of sun cream, and there's a first aid kit and things in here. Um, dining area over here. You've got uh, a little bit of fruit in the fruit bowl for you. And for those of you interested in making cocktails, we've got some bits and pieces over here. Then we go into the living room. So you've got plenty of seating in here. Um, loads of books, all different languages to read. Uh, TV with, you've got a sound system that you can just plug your phone into or your iPad or your computer. Um, DVD player. There's a, um, what else? We've got PlayStation down there. For those of you who have babies, um, we do have a cot. This obviously doesn't stay here. Um, pop it into a bedroom for you. And then in here we've got, this is our small bedroom in here, but uh, super cool, which is really nice. We've got fitted wardrobes in all of the bedrooms, so lots of space to put your things. And uh, air conditioning in all the rooms, you've got fans. But yeah, this is a, a really nice little room, especially on a really hot day. Then in here we have got the bathroom, which is shared by two, two bedrooms downstairs. So you've got fully equipped bathroom, bath, sink and toilet obviously, really nice big walk-in shower. And then next door we have the large guest bedroom. And this can be made up as a double or um, separate as a twin. So do let us know which you'd prefer. And there's doors here that open out onto the pool area. So yeah, really nice room in, room in there. Then if we go back into the living room, we've got huge, big, massive doors. All of the doors have got mosquito nets on them. Um, so definitely a good idea to keep those closed. We go out on the pool area. It's a little bit bright out here today, but pretty nice. So you've got plenty of sun lounging area. You've got a lovely little swing seat to sit and read your book. Um, pool. You'll meet Spiros, who is our pool guy. He'll come up during your stay and let him know if there's anything that you need or if there's days that don't suit him to come up. We have a really nice dining area here, covered dining area. Get a bit of shade. The traditional barbecue and there will be charcoal left for you with lighters. 
And then around here, you've just got your washing line, various bits and pieces. Um, sometimes people leave floats. Oh, we've got a baby float here at the moment, which is handy for our next guest. So you have the most amazing views from here. The bay just down in front of us is Vlijo. And then the land beyond it is still part of mainland Greece. And beyond that you have Meganissi. And on a good day you can see all the way down to Calero. But over here what you can see in the distance is still mainland Greece. But the view is incredible. One of the things, uh, one of the reasons why I bought the land here, and then the views you have in behind are just mountains. And there is nobody else beside us here. There's some few houses a little bit further down, a little bit further up, but you are completely private here. And then we will go up to the master seat. So I've got lots of little pictures on the way up here of the build of the house and the guys doing amazing stonework for me. So this is the master bedroom up here. Um, again, you have your air conditioning and your, your fan, great sized room. You have an ensuite in here your walk-in shower, which has your little picture window. It's pretty beautiful. You have a little walk-in wardrobe, loads of storage, loads of place to hang all your clothes. And then you have your own private balcony. And again, we have Mosquito nets on here. Just be careful taking them up. And we have more seating areas, some bathing areas out here. And as you can see, the view from here is pretty incredible. And the view at night is even better because there's no light pollution up here, so the stars are just amazing. I quite like to just come and sit out here before I go to bed and lay and stare at the stars. So this is my lovely home that I love to share with all of my guests. So please get in touch, see what availability we have, and I would love to welcome you here. It will be Sue who will come and meet you. Sue has been, Sue's English, she's been living on the island for over 35 years now, so fountain of knowledge for what to do and where to go. Um, so definitely quiz her on the best places to see and the best things to do. Personally, I highly recommend the Christina, the MS Christina. But we have lots of stuff up here on our board. Lots of different things to do. For those of you who love mountain biking, definitely get active. This is a friend's company. It's fantastic. This is the MS Christina. Beautiful old boat um, that gets a lot of love and attention, and they do a fantastic tour around all of the islands. There's lots of different restaurants to go to, and we do have our welcome book, which has lots of information in there of the things to do and, and places to see, and it's always, it's always good to have a flick through there. Our visitor's book love you guys all to sign it. It's so nice when I come back every year to, to see what everyone has said. And again, lots of recommendations of restaurants and beaches that people have been to. So yeah, that's, that's it. And we'd love to have you here. So thank you very much for taking the time to watch my little video.
and we hope to have you here soon.